Today's trail has been thankless, <laughs> arduous. Look at this pretty manzanita here. Lovely. Um, I had, like, okay, why did I take this hike? Because I saw that there was a trail called Chicken Shack. And I was like, I want to go on a trail named Chicken Shack. So I looked at the various trails. I came up, I don't know if you can see the hill that's through the trees there. I came up there and uh, holy cow, was that a climb. A mile and a half of basically straight up. Oh, right through here. Or the, um, that's where work is. Anyway, so, I got to the top, because I didn't come up on Chicken Shack. Ho, oh, ho, no. Came up on, like, I don't remember the name, but it had Queen in it. And, um, I planned my hike to be that one, to Chicken Shack, to Little K, K, Key, K, or Little Cat. I'm not sure why there's a discrepancy in the name. And then down, and then I'm gonna take the streets back to where I parked. So it's not really a light hike loop, but I'm making it one. Well, I mean, it's still a hike, right? Because I'm walking. And I'm not doing something else other than that. At any rate, I was tired up there. And I got to, I'm on one now maybe called Ponty. I don't remember. I saw it. It was, it was one of the possible routes. And um, it lets out basically where Chicken Shack does. But also Chicken Shack, y'all. It's called Chicken Shack. At any rate, there were um, mountain bikers up there, and I somewhat breathlessly inquired of them if the route I was going to go down was mostly downhill. And they were like, oh, it's all downhill from here. I was like, oh, thank God. Because <laughs> after my surprise 12 point something mile hike yesterday, I was like, and, and the, so mile and a half, except my, on the map, but my phone said it was like, first it said it was like three something, and then I said it was two something. Maybe I was wrong when I thought it said three something. But anyway, I'm on a series of switchbacks right now for the record, which can sometimes be disheartening because you're like here and you can see the track there, but it's not really safe to walk. Anyway, so the cyclists told me, oh, don't go that way. It's awful. It's slippery. It's steep. Lots of loose rocks. Take this other trail. And so I had been considering doing that anyway. And that was the push I needed. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear that. There's like crickets and or grasshoppers. I'm not sure what they are. They jump. They have like wings. They're bugs. Anyway, oh, there was one. So now, they, and then they told me we'll be barreling down behind you soon. We'll ring in our bells. I was like, great. I usually stick to the sides anyway. He's like, yeah, we're all doing our best. But a uh, nice group of guys. Um, I see now what they meant though, because this path almost doesn't have like a side. It is quite near. So I took my, I've been walking with like one earbud in, earbud, you, you know, one headphone in, listening to an audiobook. I think it's the first book in the Wallander series, which I've watched some or all of. It's a bleak murder mystery series set in Sweden well, and he's a cop um, uh, anyway but I took them out because uh well it out 
because I just thought, I need my wits about me if these cyclists are going to come. And the nice thing about this path, I wonder if it would stink to, to come up this way. Switchbacks can be sort of demoralizing because you feel like you're not making much forward progress. Um, I'm not sure if the trees here are burned or what. They're very dark. But the nice thing about switchbacks is they're not as steep. Like that route I took up, whoo! I'm not sure my car would make it. It was steep. That would have been at least a blue square if you had to ski it. A fun one. <laughs> um, and you know what? It was also, for the most part, in, in full sun. Just like some shade here and there. ascent and uh, this one obviously is like almost all shade so far I, I took out my made a like kind grain bar and as I was like pulling out of the, I didn't realize it was like splintered into pieces and I lost like a good quarter of it it just fell on the ground I was like well Guess I'm accidentally feeding wildlife. Chucked it. Chucked it off the side. Oh, here comes the cyclist. That's enough for now.